We know errors in credit reports can mean much higher interest rates, but there's a different report where mistakes can cost you thousands more for your insurance. And when a Sandy man found he was going to have to pay a steep price for bad information in his report, he decided to get Gephardt. Matt? Danny, Mike, yeah, if you think that your current insurance company is the only one watching your claims, think again. There is a report that nearly everyone in the insurance industry uses, and the errors on those reports can cost you. Probably over $6,000 in claims. Andy Peterson and his wife are shopping around for new insurance for both their home and their cars. My rates went up uh, quite a bit over the last year. The trouble is the new quotes they're getting are coming in even higher, way higher. When Andy asked why, an insurance company blamed him and all of the claims he's been making. Have you made a lot of claims? I haven't made any claims. My name, my wife's name. That insurance company sent him this, a list of all the claims he's allegedly made. It is all wrong. $4,400 payout on a Chevy S10. Never owned a Chevy S10. That's not your car. That's not my car. Never been your car. No. Claim after claim that Andy swears he never made on cars that he does not own and homes where he's never lived. So why in the world is Andy getting dinged for somebody else's dings? Andy asked me to investigate. It feels really unfair. Turns out the insurance industry has a network that maybe you've never heard about where they share information about you. That information is gathered into what are called clue reports, short for Comprehensive Loss Underwriting Exchange. Here's how it works. Say your car gets crunched in a crash or a tree comes crashing through your home. If you file an insurance claim, it lands on your clue report and it stays there for seven years, making sure that the next insurance company knows about it, kind of like your credit reports. We all know about credit reports. Why have we never heard of these? <laughs> you know, I don't. I don't know. We took it to Les Masterson, an insurance analyst with Forbes Advisor. He says whether you've heard of clue reports or not, they can be riddled with errors. Oh, definitely. That is really common. And those errors can have a massive impact on the price you pay. It, it can lead to hundreds or thousands of dollars more. Masterson says that even thinking about making a claim can hurt you. If you'd called the insurance company and asked, I you know, have a roof damage and I'm thinking about filing a claim, but I'm not sure. Just doing that, it ends up in your clue report, even if you don't follow through. The overwhelming majority of insurance companies use clue reports, according to Clue's owner, LexisNexis. Car owners, homeowners, and renters can pull their own clue report for free once a year, just like a credit report, and you can dispute errors. If LexisNexis investigates and agrees, or if they cannot verify those claims, they'll have to update or wipe out those errors. You're not expecting to have a history of claims come back that aren't yours, right? Andy is currently working his way through that dispute process. As for how all these bogus dings ended up his problem in the first place, he has a theory. I don't feel like it's fraud. I feel like there's probably more than one Andrew Peterson. And know this, if you use your insurance company's roadside assistance plan for things like dead batteries or flat tires, those also go on your clue reports and can impact the price you pay. With the story on KSLTV.com, I've posted a link where you can request your free clue report so you can check and see if any corrections need to be made. Now, tomorrow, Mike, I'll dive deeper into clue reports, maybe help you, maybe show how they can help you. These are designed for insurance companies, but show them how they can maybe help you when you buy a home. Yeah, let's hope so. I mean, as we know, insurance can be frustrating, right? Trying to cash in on some of that stuff. Then you have to do, deal with other layers like this, right? When there's mistakes or grabbing from other reports. Oh, what and, a headache. And a couple of bucks here and there. Oh, yeah, everything's gone up. Inflation, what are you going to do? Maybe there's a mistake that's costing you some money. Okay. All right, good stuff, Matt. Thank you. We'll see you tomorrow.